man asked Rabbi Yitzchak Zilberstein a question. He said he has a great job, he loves the job, there's so much growth opportunity, and he's making a very high salary. He uses his money to give tzedakah, he's able to hire private teachers for his children, he's able to put away savings. There's one problem with his job. He's having difficulties with Shemirat Enayim. He said the computers at the job are not filtered, and he said the people there dress immodestly. And his question was, there's another job he could take that'll pay him one third of the salary in a kosher environment. He was asking if she should switch jobs or keep what he has. Rabbi Zilberstein told him, Parnasa comes from Shamayim. Any job that is causing you to stumble in your Avodat Hashem is not a job that Hashem wants you to have. You should know you're being tested right now. But I'll tell you something. There are many sigulot for Parnasa and you can make much more money. There's a sigula we know of Shalom Bayit when you honor your wife properly. There's a sigula of Talmud Torah, learning extra Torah. There's many other sigulot. But the greatest sigula of all is Shemirat Enayim, is guarding your eyes. Because when you guard your eyes, you're automatically going to have a better Shalom Bayit. Your Torah is going to be more pure. You're going to have so much Siyata Dishmaya in many areas. Rav Chaim Palachi said on the Pasuk, Ein Echol Elecha Yisaberu. If your eyes will be towards Hashem and you'll be looking at spiritual things and turn away from things you shouldn't be looking at, Ve'ata noten lahem etochlam be'ito. Hashem will provide for you a great parnasa in the perfect time. The next time a person has a test in Shemirat Enayim, another motivation to turn away is that you are doing a sigula for parnasa.